When the economy hit an all-time low, the majority of us would feel like making money would be impossible. After all, during this time, most businesses will perform massive cost-cutting that sometimes results in a huge number of people losing their jobs, while prices are at an all-time high. The most relatable example of this is when the world was hit by the pandemic. Businesses are closing left and right and inflation is continuously increasing. In fact, it is expected to rise another 6.5% throughout 2022. Just imagining difficult times becoming more difficult, it just seems so hopeless. Well, don't worry. While a poor economy brings a lot of disadvantages, it doesn't mean all is lost and hopeless. You don't need to look far for answers because in today's video, we will be sharing with you 15 great ways to make money in a poor economy. Welcome to Thrive Test. If you're new here, why not hit that subscribe button and join our community. And as always guys, give this video a thumbs up for that YouTube algorithm. 1. Become a Billboard that may sound funny, but we truly mean becoming a walking billboard. Even while many businesses utilize digital marketing these days, there are still those that rely significantly on more traditional direct marketing methods in addition to it. One of these is the use of automobiles as moving billboards. You can sign up with companies in your neighborhood that use wrapped cars for advertising. You can continue to use your car as usual, but you'll be able to make extra money while doing it. It's a great way to let that car of yours earn its gas. Since it requires no real effort on your part regularly, just get the wrap done and you're good to go. 2. Start an Etsy store Not everyone in the world is crafty, but those who are can readily monetize their skill. Platforms like Etsy enables you to transform your small arts and crafts passion into a legitimate money-making opportunity. You can produce your works whatever they may be and list them on Etsy. If you're not very crafty, you could even do vintage goods. If someone is looking for what you're selling, they'll make an order, and you'll be able to sell your product without ever having to go out and find a client. While this can also be done through Instagram and Facebook, it will definitely take a lot more time and effort unlike on Etsy, where customers are already looking to buy something. All you need to do is list some items and you're good to go. 3. Freelance your day job skills Arts and crafts may not be everyone's cup of tea, but most of us have day jobs, right? Not all day jobs are fancy. You may be a locksmith, a professional organizer, a hairdresser, or even a caregiver. Whatever it is, it's something you do for a living. Thus, you should be really good at it. One disadvantage of day jobs is that you can only make a certain amount of money in a certain length of time. But because you're gaining experience, it's usually still valuable. That experience can be leveraged to take on additional freelancing jobs. You'll be doing the same thing you do at work, but you'll make extra money on the side. This is ideal for people whose employers do not provide overtime. You can also market your skills on Craigslist, a local freelancing website, or even a community billboard. In any case, you'll be able to make some more money doing something you already do every day. So even if your salary at your day job doesn't increase, you'll still make a little extra money. 4. Take advantage of the situation now. This may sound a little rude, but it's just basic economics. The world operates on the principle of supply and demand. When something in the world shifts, new demands come up, allowing additional suppliers to enter and plug the gap. Let's take Malaysia for example. In this country, rain may fall any time of the day. So umbrella sellers are quite common and when it rains, they pop up with their grab-and-go umbrellas so people who didn't come prepared can shield themselves from the weather. See, there's an instant demand, so does the supply. So what you need to do right now is take a look around you and ask yourself, what do people need right now? Then meet the demand, whether it's face masks, umbrellas, or lemonade on a hot summer day. Whatever the circumstance is, there's always something you can do to capitalize on. 5. Pick up another job The globe has already been through several recessions, and one piece of advice that always comes up is the usual take up another job. Back in the day, this meant you had to go out and obtain another physically demanding work, which would pay you but would also involve a lot of extra physical effort, which would not be substantial in the long run. However, with the emergence of the internet, you can now take up extra work anywhere in the world and complete it from the comfort of your own home. If you're good at something, you can tutor someone online for an hour a day. 
You could work as a social media manager if you're skilled at it. Remote jobs enable you to earn money in a bad economy without putting in a lot of physical work or relocating. 6. Set up an Airbnb Why not use a spare room in your house to make money in a bad economy? Even when things are awful, there are always those that travel around. Some for leisure, some for necessity, and what do all travelers require? A place to stay. Previously, you would have had to spend hundreds if not millions of dollars to set up a guest house that might potentially turn a profit. Today, an unoccupied room may be an instant moneymaker. 7. Become an Amazon reseller or drop shipper. Amazon isn't the only site where you can purchase everything. It's also the place where you can sell almost anything. That means you can offer something for sale on Amazon and sell it. And this does not imply that you must buy a large quantity of inventory in order to sell something. You could even try dropshipping. Dropshipping involves listing things on your store that you don't have yet. So there is no real inventory to keep your consumers happy. You place an order on your Amazon store and your manufacturer then ships the item directly to your customers. You make money here by modestly raising the price of the product because you won't be paying for shipping or inventory charges. Thus, your entire markup is your profit. 8. Make money off used goods The vehicle industry may not always be doing well, but the used car market is almost always thriving. No matter where you reside, there is almost certainly a wonderful car showroom nearby that sells used cars. That is an excellent opportunity for you to earn money. All you have to do is save enough money to purchase one second-hand car. Choose anything with some repair potential, then patch it up and resell it for a greater price. The repaired edition will very certainly make far more money than you spent on it. This approach may be used in almost any industry, including shoes, bags, and phones. Simply buy as cheaply as possible and sell it for a profit. And you'll make money regardless of how the economy performs. 9. Set up an online garage sale Even though we don't want to admit it, many of us are hoarders in some form. We're all holding on to something. Whether it's collecting way too many Pokemon cards or refusing to let go of a pair of shoes that don't fit. If a traditional garage sale isn't your thing, you can hold one online. To get rid of items that are just collecting dust in your house, and turn that dust into money. But this can be accomplished by using applications like Poshmark or simply posting your items on social media accounts and seeing if anyone is prepared to pay for them. That way, you can clean your closets while also earning money. 10. Deliveries Regardless of what's happening in the world, people need to eat. You might be thinking, what does it have to do with making money? Well, with more and more people opting for a work-from-home setup, more people would bite into the idea of convenience. And what's the most enticing form of convenience? That would be food delivery. You may easily sign up to be an Uber Eats driver using sites like Uber. The best part is that you don't have to quit your day job or work long, stressful hours. Simply pick up a few hours here and there and you'll still make a fair income. 11. Ride online These days, it's as though we're living in two distinct worlds. The first is the physical world, and the second is the online world. While we may be able to get by in the physical world on our own, the world online is limitless. And if you have a writing talent, you can find your own place in it as well. You may sign up on any writing platform and get employed to write online, because the majority of the internet relies on people to convey their messages through words. One of the most appealing aspects of this is that you may work for anyone from anywhere in the world and still earn money. If you enjoy writing, this is an excellent opportunity for you. You can work from home or go the nomadic freelancing way and work from any place. 12. Become a virtual assistant Many people in the world are so busy that they don't have time to plan their day. On the other side, some people are overly organized, and if you're one of them, you can easily become someone's virtual assistant. These positions are available online, and you don't even have to be in the same country as your employer. All you have to do is ensure that their appointments are scheduled, emails are sent, and errands are completed. They'll walk you through everything that has to be done, and it'll all be done online. It's a quick and simple way to make money regardless of where you are or how the economy is doing. 13. Online Mock Juror Being an online mock juror may appear to be a hassle, but it pays well. 
Mock juries are used by legal teams to determine the strength of their case. The task at hand is relatively simple. Simply sign up, review the case records, and assist as needed. You'll get compensated for your time, and your task will be to create an opinion regarding what you've heard. It's quite easy money if you ask me. 14. Use your listening skills. Not everyone is a good listener, but those who are can benefit from their abilities. Various firms are looking for people to transcribe their audio and video files into words. These files can range from lectures or seminars to basic YouTube videos like this one. All you have to do is listen and see as money is deposited into your bank account. 15. Teach. Teaching others how to be good at something is one of the best ways to make money. Makeup lessons, cooking classes, and art workshops are all opportunities. As long as you're good at something, you may teach it to others, whether in person or online. That way, regardless of the state of the economy, you'll be helping them in learning something new and at the same time earning you money. Before we wrap up today's video, I'd like to know where are you watching this video from? Do you think that the things mentioned in this list would be beneficial in your country and its current economic situation? Please let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below, as your opinions truly matter to us. If you're trying to overcome the consequences of a bad economy in your country, how about looking outside of it? They say the world isn't getting smaller, as the online world continues to grow. So, if your country's economy isn't doing so well, how about consider looking at freelancing websites like Fiverr to see what other people are doing and figure out what you could offer. Sometimes, we are too busy making money that we tend to overlook the things that we already have, including our talents and skills. But by exploring freelancing platforms, you will get the ideas of the things that you could actually offer online. Thank you for watching this Thrive-tastic video. So if you found it valuable, consider subscribing to our channel and joining our awesome community. And if you're still hungry for more, we handpicked this awesome, thrive video for you to watch next.